We need a new coach. Bay! Tampa Bay! Fire Nick Sirianni, hiring Bill Belichick, and retooling this team. Hey, what's going on? It's Rolante. I'm currently outside of Raymond James Stadium, bar 76 to be exact. It is currently the Tampa Bay Buccaneers versus the Philadelphia Eagles. I'm with Fangold Media. You can check us out on YouTube. Make sure you like, subscribe, and comment. You can also check me out on Instagram, la underscore, underscore grand underscore uno. Who do you think was the impact player of the game? Oh, I think Baker Mayfield, you know. He's bringing, uh, bringing his talents to the Tampa Bay area. Second year, he's been doing great. And looking forward to uh, this Thursday against the Atlanta Falcons. Yes, sir. How do you think the outcome will be? Oh, I think the Bucks are going to win, you know, by 50. By 50? Yes, sir. Yeah, always. Ah, he's a confident one. Today they came out on top. They were fast, short passes, established themselves, then established the run, got down the field, kept them off balance, and a real good game. Defense-wise, we came out, we shut them down three times in a row from over the game, which was perfect for that first half. We got a little tired in the second, but we did better starting off on this third half, especially with the turnovers. So we've been doing really good this week. And who, who would you give the player of the game to? Right now, right now with the, the, the heart of it, I'm going to have to give it to the turnovers by the defense. Ah, okay. they, they got some turnovers that we turn, make, we capitalize on some points. A lot of other fans gave it to Baker. I understand that, but that defense, we needed a solid defensive performance. That like, Last week, they went and show up. They hurt themselves with hurts, drops, and, you know, they just couldn't, they just couldn't contain him. The defense was kind of non-existent. I'm um, beginning to lose confidence. I'd like to say the Phillies just can't play in the heat. <laughs> so it's the, it's the floor of the heat that's, that's getting to them? It could be. That's a factor. I'll take that. We got a bye week coming up. Nick Sirianni's out. Bill Belichick's coming in and retooling this team. How about you? I'm, I'm Googling a new team because I, I need to get another jersey. So you're out? I'm, I'm out of this shit. You're burning it or you're tossing it? Both of them. How about you? Get them out of there. We tried again. Get Jalen Hurt, go. Nick Sirianni, go. Start regroup. Do you think quarterback? We need a real quarterback. Need a quarterback. Is, is, is Jalen Hurts overpaid? Yeah, he overpaid. Yeah, he overpaid. He overpaid. Oh, for sure. Saquon and Jalen Mitchell are our saviors. You know, could have done better. He got to him, had a great game plan, quick passes, you know, get the defense worn out. Offense, you know, got the studs out. I see you got, you got the, the uh, Jalen Hurts jersey on. Is he at fault or is the overall team? You know, I mean, he, he, got, he has a have to have a better pocket presence. That's about it, but you know, it is what it is. Come back, you know, two weeks from now, hopefully they do well. I feel real good about the Bucks this week. Last week they were asleep, they woke up and kicked butt. So it was a great overall team win? Yes, it was. They played, they came to play today. And who would you give the MVP of the game to? Mm, my man, right here, look. Ah, Mike Evans, her man. I think he had what, two touchdowns today? Two. And do you think Baker can beat the Falcons next this Thursday? Yeah, yes. 100%. Yes. What is the Falcon? What is the Falcon? I mean, we yeah. already got the Eagle. What is the Falcon? If we had our two receivers in Devontae and AJ, it would have been a lot better game. But we had all the momentum in the second half after Barkley got us down to the red zone. But Jalen can't keep turning the ball over when we go back to the red zone. That's what killed the momentum, in my opinion. So do you think Jalen's a problem or it's a team overall issue? Uh, I wouldn't say Jalen's a problem. I just say we got to figure out how to how the hell to stop turning the ball over. A lot of people are saying they would get rid of the coach. Would you get rid of the coach? I don't think today was on him. Uh, I was more frustrated with the New Orleans decisions and with the Atlanta decisions. Uh, okay. But not so today. He didn't do too bad. It was more the players' execution today, in my opinion. Okay. The Eagles lost, and they've been talking all week. I heard a lot of noise this, this 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 afternoon from the Eagles. Yeah, I don't hear anything anymore. Uh, yeah, yeah, I bet I don't hear anything anymore. A lot of quiet. It's kind of hard. Yeah, the, there was a lot of people leaving trying to beat the traffic. Tom Baker beat the Falcons. Yes, sir. Screw Kirk Cousins. Screw Kirk Cousins. Yeah, he's not him. He's not him. No, Baker Mayfield is him. <laughs> ah, so Baker's him. So would you say Baker's a new Tom? Yeah, a hundred percent. We should have had Baker back up Tom for a year. Ah, I, hey, that's a. I'm not knocking that. I was a little nervous coming in. Uh, I thought the Eagles were going to come in here with vengeance after we, after we beat them out of the playoffs. But nope, they couldn't handle Baker Mayfield sizzling bacon. <laughs> <laughs>
Yeah, it was a great game. It was so good. Uh, number 17 came out of nowhere. Shepard. Yeah. He's my Shepherd. new favorite. Yeah. So Shepard's impact of the game for you? Yeah. Shepard was awesome. Oh my goodness, where did he come from? <laughs> I'm not sure who Shepard is. I'm not sure what he did. Uh, number 17, he was just scoring catching and, and catching. Yep. yep. Uh, so we have a new impact player, huh? Absolutely. I'm wrapping outside of Raymond James Stadium. Final score. Tampa Bay Buccaneers 33, Philadelphia Eagles 16. Buccaneers going to face Atlanta Falcons this Thursday. Make sure you subscribe and like, comment to our YouTube page, Fan Gold Media.